Hey guys, what is going on? Lego Man 123 and welcome back to another video where today I'll be reviewing the Lego Creator 3 in 1 Downtown Noodle Shop set 31131. So, starting off with the minifigures in this set, you do get two. However, we'll start with the more interesting one first. And that is because this minifigure actually has a hearing aid printed on the side of her head, which is something I've actually never seen before, especially with adding a print on the side as well as a hearing aid, because it really goes to show how realistic and just how accurate LEGO wants their minifigures to be. And I also really like the torso as well with both the printing on the back and front as for the next minifigure, there's nothing too special about him because most of the pieces we have gotten before, but it's really nice to get another chef outfit as well as that really nice hairpiece in black and his facial expression is also really nice to get in a set like this. Before we move on to the main build for the set, you also do get two smaller builds. The first one being a brick build dog, and I do like the overall design for it, especially with the part usage. However, I prefer the molds for the animals as well as pets within LEGO sets because I just feel like the scaling with a brick built animal and the minifigure, they just don't really match as well as you hope because that would be a huge dog to see side by side with a minifigure so i prefer to have the molds because i feel like it's a bit more accurate and it just works a little more better as for the next build it is an ice cream bicycle and what i like most about this build is just how compacted and simple the design is but just how well designed it is as well i love all the features and just the details included in such a small and compacted area. But I also like the colours they've chosen because it definitely stands out from other builds within my city. And I also love the 3D sign of the ice cream cone with four scoops of different flavours of ice cream because it just works so well and I just love how they've been able to design it. So starting off with the design for the set, it honestly looks incredible. I love the amount of detail and features included. I love the colour scheme for it. I love all the little ideas throughout the build. It just looks so awesome. As to how the set looks, I love how it has this very modern and quite unique design to it because it's definitely able to stand out from other LEGO Creator 3 in 1 sets. And because of that, I would honestly say that this is probably one of LEGO's best LEGO Creator 3-in-1 sets they've done. So, starting off with the Noodle Shop, what I love most about it is just how opening and warm welcoming it is, rather than being enclosed within inside the actual set. And I also like how it has either Chinese or Japanese designs built into it. And then it also does have a sticker displaying what you can actually buy at the noodle shop. Then turning the set around, it does reveal a 3D sign promoting the noodle shop, which is a noodle box with chopsticks. Then a sticker to represent a golden dragon and I love how simple but effective that design is and it's probably one of my favorite 3D signs. As for the street name that has to be one of my favorite and just one of the funniest easter eggs I've seen in a lego creator street calling the street creator. As for the vending machine I really wish they found a way to actually 
have a brick built one that actually works rather than just having a very simple design for one that doesn't work because I would love to see them actually have a minifig scale version of a working vending machine within one of their sets because I just think it will add so much more to the build. Then following these stairs up to the second floor, it does reveal a, a somewhat apartment design. But turning it around also does reveal a bit more within the noodle shop, that being a stovetop build, as well as just seeing a few more of the details from the other side. So starting off with this small section here, eventually leading up to the third floor, we have this really nice build for a flower in a vase, as well as that classic 2x2 two two tile with the greatest hero printed on it. Then we have a living room, which includes a small build for a rug, as well as a couch, and then a table, which has a radio and a few plants on it, and then in the background we have a lamp. Then, turning the set around, it does reveal some plants outside the window, but to actually get to the third and final floor, you can actually access it through this little trapdoor here, and it does reveal a bird chilling out next to a antenna, and then on the other side is a somewhat designed for a bonsai tree in my opinion, and I just love the way it looks and just how it's up on the third and final floor. And just like most of these LEGO Creator 3 in 1 sets, you are able to close it and open it back up again. But I prefer to have it opened up and to actually have it displayed in like this sort of corner design. But you are able to also have it like that. And I do like the design for it, but I definitely prefer to have it opened up. So now take a look at the packaging for the set, starting off with the box. In all honesty, I've definitely seen a lot more better box art before in other LEGO Creator 3-in-1 sets because they honestly could have put in just a lot more effort. And as for the other two builds, you can create a arcade as well as a bicycle, apartment and newspaper stand build. And then turning the box around, it does reveal just a bit more of a better picture at the other three sets, as well as that closing feature on one of the main builds. Then as for the manuals, like most LEGO Crayon sets, you do get three, one each for the different builds. And... If I remember correctly, the only one that has advertisements is, I believe, this one. Yes, it does. And the advertisements it does show is just all the other LEGO Creator 3-in-1 sets in this wave. Overall, this is probably going to be one of my new favorite LEGO Creator 3-in-1 sets because not only is the build and look really unique and definitely stands out from other LEGO Creator 3-in-1 sets in my city, but it also includes some really interesting features and details and just the overall way it's designed as well as it's able to incorporate either Chinese or Japanese culture into its build. But, as always guys, I would definitely love to hear your thoughts and opinions down in the comments below about this set. And as always guys, hope you guys did enjoy this sort of anakinesis. So, goodbye!